uh, going to show you this little, what we refer to as a little cheat bait. This is a little bay squid, which in these areas are fantastic. Now, they're not freely available in the shops. You can, after phoning a lot of people, you might get a couple. There's a couple of guys that net them in the harbors. But they're deadly baits. The unfortunate part about them is uh, it costs you over 30 rand each. And uh, a pecker will not swim past this either. However, it's always surprised us with the species it lures in. You can hook a 100 kilo honey on this. You can hook a 100 kilo sandy on this. You can hook pretty much anything, all the kingy, kingies. I'm sure a cob won't swim past this, but that's not uh, what it's targeting. Pompano and any other nice edible fish would love this. Now what I've done, I've taken a 6-0 Mustad ring soy. I've put high density phone, I use a toothpick to secure it so it can't move up and down if I clip to get more distance. I'm going to fish a cone, the sea has gone a bit big though, but I'm still going to try a 6 ounce cone and uh, for it to move around, just wash off the sides of banks and stuff, that's the whole idea. Now you're going to secure this onto the foam, the, the inside, the intestines and the little, the head and make it stick out pretty much there, I'm happy with it. is going to secure the top and then fold this bottom nicely open and put some wraps there take the little beak out then it doesn't cool as bad but it doesn't really matter with the base bit so small and then cross wrap over the eyes Brings them out nicely as you can see. And caught onto the toothpick, so I'll secure it that way. And then the other one, cross wrap this side. It's like tying a fly. There you go. Alright. Okay, alright. And these little tentacles. Get them down. Oh, nice. Then I cut it open. There's the little little cartilage inside that I take out. And then on the inside of this, you just lightly bang it with the back of your knife because it's so thin and delicate. You don't want to puncture it. You just want to give it a nice texture so that your cotton wraps nicely and holds it as well as brings out more of that smell deadly smell this this is one of those baits that can go rotten in your bait box and you're still going to put it on not because it costs 30 bucks but because it still works now this one specifically remember it's not beaten on the other side so i want to tie it just here on the toothpick a little bit tighter so that I know that doesn't push up or slip up again. And you can even from there, just to secure it, go around the eyes again. One, two over that, and then over the eyes this side. Don't want to restrict my tentacles. Okay. That should hold, won't slip. Deadly, deadly bait, guys. Now I'm hoping this will live up to its potential today and there won't be pickers because <laughs> that will be disappointing. 